I loved you for so many years, but you know what? You didn't exist. You don't exist. You're not there. You're not there. You were a made up thing in my head. And I, I can't believe you're doing this to me. Stop. I can't believe it. There's no need to be cruel on top of it. You've been nothing but cruel. So here's the million dollar question. Do girls ever take guys out on dates? Million dollars on the line here, fellas. Do girls ever take guys out on dates? A, yes. B, hell to the no. Do girls ever take guys out on dates? Absolutely. Court dates. You don't want to make nice nice? I'm trying. Amber, Thank you. this is my, no, this is me. This is me saying I tried. And thank you, and I will see you in court. 16 paranoia filled days later. Can you please tell the jury why you're here today? Um, yes. Um, about six years ago, um, uh, Miss Hurd made a uh, some quite heinous and um, uh, disturbing uh, brought these disturbing criminal um, acts um, against uh, me. So the first point that I want to make, why do women lie and falsely accuse men of things they did not do? Because if you look at Famous celebrities, big name athletes like Deshaun Watson. So why did Amber Heard accuse Mr. Johnny Depp of beating her, judo slamming her? Finish her. I did not punch you. I did not deck you. That is Amber yelling at Johnny, the verbal altercation after a physical one between the two. I didn't punch you, by no. the way. You, I'm sorry that I didn't uh, uh, hit you across the face in a proper slap, but I was hitting you. It was not punching you. You're fine. I did not hurt you. I did not punch you. I was hitting you. How are you? How, what am I supposed to do? Do this? I, I'm not sitting here about it, am I? You are. That's the difference between me and you. You're a baby. The audio of the undated brawl played in court. So why do we keep seeing cases like this of women falsely accusing men of things they never did or done. You look at the Deshaun Watson case. You look at Mr. Johnny Depp's case. All these cases have one common denominator. I want you guys to look at the thing between her legs. Miss Amber Heard knows that she is a woman and she can get away with it because the court is always going to favor the woman's side and people are always gonna favor her side, stand by her side, and support her. Why? Just because she has a fish hole. Some might be smellier than others. Yo pussy stank. Yo pussy stank. Yo pussy stank. Yo pussy stank. Feminine wash. And some might be hairier than others. And fellas, Miss Amber Heard knows that if she falsely accuses of Mr. Depp, and if the court catches her falsely accusing him, she knows that nothing is going to happen and there is no repercussions or consequences for her actions. Fellas, when a man gets emotionally abused by a woman, it's considered funny and hilarious. And if you look at this, from a realistic standpoint, there is no laws that protects men from domestic violence or from a vindictive woman like Amber Heard. And fellas, I wanna show you guys this spine tingling audio message that was recorded by Amber Heard saying that to Johnny Depp, that the court is not going to believe you because you're a man. You can please tell people that it was a fair fight and see what the judge, 
the jury and judge think. Tell the world, Johnny. Tell them, Johnny Depp. I, Johnny Depp, man, I, I'm a victim too of domestic violence. And yes. I, you know, it's a fair fight. It sees how many people believe or side with you. It sees how many people believe or side with you. It doesn't matter if it's a fair, fair fight. My exactly, because you're big, you're bigger and you're stronger. And so when I say that I thought you could kill me, that doesn't mean you counter with you also uh, that, that, that you lost your own finger. I, I am not trying to attack you here. I'm just trying to point out the fact of why I said call 911. Because I was, you were, you had your hands on me after you threw a phone in my face, and I just got crazy in the past, and I truly thought I need to stop this madness before I get hurt. Oh my God! Without a shadow of a doubt, there needs to be a law that protects men from a woman falsely accusing him. That there needs to be jail time, and I here stand by, Mr. Johnny Depp. Justice for Johnny Depp, my cheek slaying soldiers who's with me. The truth of a matter of fact is that Miss Amber Heard is not the victim. She is the abuser. The real victim here is Mr. Johnny Depp. For the first time, Johnny on the record, alleging his wife threw not one, but two bottles of vodka at him after an argument in 2015. She threw the large bottle, and it made contact and shattered uh, everywhere. And then I looked down and realized that the, the, the tip of my finger had been severed. Johnny Depp, be like, I have the facts and the evidence right here that my ex-wife pulled a Will Smith on me. And left a bruise on my face. The evidence is right here. But Amber Heard be like, huh, but I'm somewhat of a woman myself. You know, I'm something of a scream, gobblers. It's myself. And while Amber has previously denied Johnny's allegations, he insisted it happened in Australia one month after their wedding. I knew in my heart, this is, this is not life. Now, I want to dive deeper. We are about to conduct a CSI, a cheek slaying investigation. I wanted to dive deep into Amber Heard's past and see a pattern in her behavior because as humans, we are what we repeatedly do. And you guys will not believe the shit that I dug up. Now remember this, all women are bi. You just have to figure out if she's bipolar or bisexual. And in this case, Miss Amber Heard is both creep gobblers. Now I want you guys to pay attention to Amber Heard's past relationship with Tasia. This lesbian couple, well shit, if they're lesbian, I'm lesbian too, God damn it. But you guys will not believe the shit that I dug up. Have a look at this. Amber Heard was accused of abusing ex-girlfriend Tasia Vaughn Ray in 2009. Doesn't that sound very familiar to a case we're talking about? Heard had been arrested by Port of Seattle Police on September 14, 2009. After the actress and her then girlfriend, Tasia Vaughn Ray, got into an altercation at the airport after Heard allegedly grabbed and struck Van Ray's arm. Sound like she also kind of pulled a Will Smith. I've said this many times on the channel, but I will say it again. If you don't pay attention to a woman's past, her past will come back and ruin your future. Not only did Miss Amber Heard made Tasia's life a living hell, but Amber Heard also destroyed, tarnished, and absolutely obliterated Johnny Depp's reputation because society 
has now labeled Johnny Depp, a man who used to be such a positive guy, who is one hell of an actor, but now he is labeled as a woman beater. He even lost his job at Disney because of Amber Heard. And on top of that, Amber Heard attacked Johnny Depp where it hurts the most. Amber Heard manipulated his family, his son, their son, that his father was a woman beater. Take a look at this recorded audio. That was a pro-act, you're not understand that. There's a pro-act step. I had to respond. You cannot automatically, you okay. cannot think that it's just my side. You're f killing me. It's Your f people are trying to kill me. You've turned me into a no, My boy has to go to school. My boy goes to school and has kids go, so your dad's a wife beater? You don't think about that, Amber. You don't think, you don't think that's also my family and all the death threats, me and every single person in my immediate circle of friends and family is getting also matters? I mean, you don't think I, you think I death would Death threats? According to the book of the cheek pounding prophecy, Proverbs 69, scripture thought of ladians, it states, have you guys ever wondered why the word man has three letters? Just like how God has three letters, because all a man wants is peace. But have you guys ever wondered why the word woman has five letters? Just like the word devil has five letters because some of these cream goblin medusas are out here to get you and suck you and send you into the shadow realms with her. <laughs> it's very unfortunate that men at a young age were taught to be faithful, taught to give women the world. And in this case, you can tell Johnny from the bottom of his heart loves Amber Heard, but it's unfortunate that men were taught all this to give women the world. But 99.9999999999% of the time, men always get the short end of the stick. Now, if you analyze this with your cheek slang Sharinga, if you analyze Amber Heard's behavior and characteristics, she is a certified narcissist and a sociopath because she is the type of person that will tear down a person's life just so she can feel better about herself. And if you understand human psychology of a narcissist and a sociopath, they have no sympathy. They will gaslight you and make you feel that you are the problem. But in reality, they are the problem, but they gaslight you and emotionally manipulate you to the point where you're second guessing yourself. And fellas, and if you guys have ever been in an abusive relationship and people ask you, why can't you leave? It's easier said than done because if you guys have been in an abusive relationship, let me break it down to you guys. What the narcissist does is they emotionally manipulate and they will tear down a person's self-esteem so much that that person feels that they can never be loved, that they deserve to be treated this way, that the narcissist is the only person that was there for them. They will gaslight the other person and be like, oh, remember when I was there for you, I did this for you, X, Y, and Z. It's a form of gaslighting. And I also wanna show you guys this clip where Johnny Depp asks Amber Heard if he ever abused her and watch how she gaslights him plays the victim, runs around circles, and avoids the question. I can talk about all of this. Do you believe all this, Emma? Oh, Do you believe I'm all this? Yes, yes. You, you, believe, you believe I'm an abuser? Yes. You believe I'm an abuser? In May, in December, in, in April. Uh, Do you believe I you're an abuser? No. Do you believe you abused me I physically? Believe. Do I physically believe, I mean, do I believe I physically abused you? Yes. 
do you know I'm 115, well, not anymore, but I was 115 pounds. I'm that's, a 115 pound woman, and you're going to say I have, I have the capacity to be. That's, 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 that's not the question. That's not the question. Have I ever been able to knock you off of your feet? You started. Off your you started these things. You were, you were, you were going to get up on the stand, Johnny, and say she started it? Really? I have never been able to overpower you. That's the difference between me and you. Why did you try? And that's the difference that the whole world and that a jury and that a judge will see is that there is a very big difference between me and you. And all of your, all of the people that have come out and lied on your behalf that I, that I can prove as lied, whether it be a text messages that can be authenticated by third party forensic, uh, 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 electronic forensic experts, or if it's um, audio. If it's this situation is extremely heartbreaking and unfortunate because Johnny Depp, he is one hell of an icon. He is one hell of an actor, an extremely gifted man. But unfortunately, his life has fallen by the hands of a cream gobbler. And remember gentlemen, when a man is striving in life, there's always a woman out there to fuck it up. And fellas, this is extremely random, but Amber Heard is extremely flat-chested. And according to the cheek slaying constitution, it states, women are kind of like rocks. We leave the big ones and we skip the flat ones. Perfect, perfect, perfect. 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 Amber Heard is so flat chested that all the kids in physical education class use her titty as a yoga mat. Boys have a penis, girls have a vagina. <laughs> Thanks for the tip. Now, gentlemen, before I end this video, may we have a moment of silence to send our thoughts, prayers, and blessings to let Mr. Johnny Depp know that his brothers are standing by his side and rooting for him because justice for Johnny Depp. At this time, please stand and join in a moment of silent reflection in memory of Johnny. May the cheek slang fathers guide Johnny Depp to the light. Now, before I end this video, let me conclude this video with this quote. Gentlemen, never forget that there is no woman out there more beautiful than your freedom. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Yes? Oh, are you gonna always gonna be that rude and interrupt when I'm trying to talk? I just want more pumpkin, that's all I want. Right, well I'll get you more pumpkin, I'll ram it right up your fucking ass. Would you like it whole or dice? Can we get security and get Nob back to the seat, please, yeah? <laughs> Yo, 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 yo. <laughs>